everything you know about this company called Redbubble is wrong. All of the information that you've seen before April 19th, 2023, that's uploaded before that date, is wrong. Now, I'm going to tell you exactly why, but before we do, remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more. What's going on? Why is there a boycott? What What's happening with this, with this company, Redbubble? Well, basically, they have taken upon themselves, this company, Redbubble, to slash artists' commissions in half. Why is this important? Well, back, you know, like even now, before this entire thing was introduced, before this, you know, the tier system was introduced, basically artist commissions were, you know, low but fair as it was. So let's just say I sold a sticker on Redbubble for $3. I would make whatever it is, a dollar or so, you know. So it, was not, it wasn't terrible. And that added up to a lot. I mean, there was one time I sold stickers on Redbubble. I sold 100 stickers in, you know, one sitting, and I got uh, whatever it was, 200 stickers, whatever, however many this person bought. And I got, you know, $100 just by one sale. So I couldn't complain. It was fine. But now these commissions have literally been sliced in half. Now, the commissions that, you know, you used to be making like $7 every $25 shirt sold, let's just say, now that commission is going to be like $4, maybe, probably even less than that. Every $2 that you sold, you know, right now in terms of the tier system, right now, every $2 that you make on Redbubble, they take a dollar. That's the fee. They take half of your, just your commissions. Forget how much the item sells. Forget all that. Every $2, they take a buck. And um, it's disgusting. People are moving moving away from this company. That This is why they're boycotting. They've taken it upon themselves, these artists have, that have, that have sold on Redbubble. And have said, we had enough. <laughs> We've had enough. Including myself, I, I am not going to upload a single item on Redbubble ever again for as long as these tier systems are there. Now, I may not even upload anything again regardless because Redbubble has become such a terrible, terrible platform in terms of selling items. They are almost like, you know, uh, like um, a company that what, it was kind of like a has-been company almost at this point. Like they've basically become a company such as uh, Zazzle, you know, a company that used to do very well in in the market and now they're they're like done they're struggling like crazy zazzle has so redbubble they're just another zazzle it looks like they might be going the same way their stock price was like five dollars something cents back in like july 2021 now their stock price is only about 28 cents as of making this video and there's no excuse for it either Redbubble has completely messed up their entire business model, and now they're punishing the artists to try to make more money from them, people that run the site themselves. If it wasn't for them, there would be no Redbubble, quite literally. And um, so this is all brand new. All of it, it's all brand new. This is just introduced just the other day. And now it's going to take effect May of this year. And whether or not they're going to keep it remains to be seen. But right now, because there's a huge boycott, everything like that, they're, they're, they might change it. But right now, there there's no sign of, of them doing that. And I don't think they will. I don't, I don't think that these companies really understand the power that the person has to just not upload their, to their site anymore. They're ta they think that we're, you know people are stupid, that they'll continue to upload to their site because they have no money or whatever, then they they need whatever they're whatever they're giving them. Well, guess what? There are alternatives out there, like Printful, like um, you know, you submit to Printful and you you can sell anywhere you want. You can sell on Shopify, you can sell on Etsy, you can sell on every, anywhere, really, and make that extra money. And it's a lot better in your pocket than selling on Redbubble. You can basically make your own website and never be banned than selling on Redbubble, which they ban people you know all the time with a snap of a finger 
Actually, it's not even a snap of a finger. It's really the uh, the glitch, the glitch in, in the computer. <laughs> With one glitch of a computer, you're banned, basically. You wake up one day and your shop is gone. Why would you want that? It makes no sense for me or anybody else out there, in my opinion. So, that's just my two cents. But everything that has been, you know, broadcast or whatever before, whatever it is, um, April 19th, 2023, that's uh, just ignore it, unfortunately, because now Redbubble has com- completely gone in a different direction. They're no longer a viable option in terms of you selling print-on-demand products, in my opinion. It's just not It's just not going to work. The profits are just not there. That's just plain and simple. The, the time and effort that you put in to submit products to that, to that website is not worth what they're giving you for it, what, you're, what they're selling the, the products for. It's no longer worth it. It used to be. It used to be fine. It used to be like you just, you know, you didn't pay a dime to submit all your products uh, you know, your designs onto this particular website, then the products were sold and everything like that on Redbubble and whatnot. And you got a so, a, uh, a low but somewhat fair commission. That's so, that's so over. You're not getting a fair commission anymore on this website. It's That's done. So um, that's my opinion, and I'm sticking to that. If you have a different opinion, I, I really would love to hear it. Remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.